Hi, um, my name is Dana Hudson. I will be your host this morning for Planning for Senior Life University channel. And with me, I am thrilled to have Dr. Angela McConnell. She's the owner and CEO of Q Integrative Health Consulting, as well as an adjunct professor at the George Washington University School of Medicine and Health Sciences, and a 22 year veteran of the US military. Um, but today she's gonna to join us as the leader and founder of the Northern Virginia Veterans Association here, or Nova Vets, as it's more commonly called. There's a very special story um, that you have shared that I've read that illustrates exactly how Nova Vets supports the veterans in the community. Would you mind sharing that with us? I love this story. This, this is a wonderful story about a Marine Corps veteran, um, elderly veteran um, that was in need of surgery. Um, he had to have an organ replaced. And what was going on during this time is he had a beautiful um, yellow lab, Sasha, which was at his side always. They were going out for walks every day. But as his health started to deteriorate, um, he needed more support with Sasha. And he knew he was gonna be going into the VA for this organ transplant surgery. So he was going in multiple times. I think he was rushed in six different times for an organ that ended up not working out for him. And, and eventually um, Robert early on found us just for some transportation needs. And then we learned because we do a comprehensive intake mm -hmm. that um, he not only needed transportation needs, he needed someone to help with Sasha and then potentially watch Sasha. So we reached out um, when we knew he had this need and an organization called Pact for Animals, which is a fabulous nonprofit. They, they literally find homes for pets of veterans and deploying service members that need their pets to be watched and they wanna ensure their beloved pets are there when they return. So PACT found us through Facebook, someone that saw us on Facebook and knew what they did and then made the connection. And in addition to that, as we were looking for a family to um, foster Sasha, we put it out on Facebook again. And there was, a, there was a family member of a family member that found a wonderful foster family in Fauquier County. And they became fast friends with Robert and Sasha, watched Sasha for over a month and um, loved Sasha and Robert so much. Um, Robert put it in his will to have Sasha um, live with this family if anything was to ever happen to Robert. So again, a beautiful example of how just the community comes together mm -hmm. in support of these things. And I mean, social media has been fabulous for these connections, um, people that we probably couldn't have reached otherwise. And Robert's doing great. Um, as soon as he is able, he will come out. I believe he'll be at our 9th September gala at the Sweeney Bar in Manassas as one of our honored veterans we're bringing in um, a handful of our wonderful honored veterans and hopefully Robert can be one of them. Such a great story, Dr. McConnell. Thank you so much for sharing and thank you so much for the work that you do um, for our veterans and, and for your service. We are so grateful. Um, and if you all would like to learn more about Nova Vets or more about what we do and, and the professionals that are parts of Planning for Senior Life, please visit us at planningforseniorlife.com. And um, Dr. McConnell, we hope to have you back in the future and best of luck with all the rest of the year. Thanks thank so much. You. Yes, thanks for having me. Have a wonderful day. Thanks.